Let's just put this back up here, shall we? So it looks, you know, neat and tidy and complete. What's up guys, Liam here. Welcome back to LSJ TV. You guys see the title of today's video. A little bit different to what we would normally be doing. We're behind the clearway wall or, or I'm in front of the clearway wall. And basically what I'm gonna be doing is a Jelly Belly taste test. So inside this shaker, this is actually something that you guys can pick up on the site using code LSJ at checkout. If you are new here, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, I'm a my protein athlete. I have been for about two, three years now. I have a code LSJ. It is the same as the channel name. So any confusion, just let me know. Send over your orders if you do decide to cop any of this or if you decide to cop anything off of the site using discount code LSJ at checkout. Let me know and I'll enter your names into the monthly giveaway that I'll be doing next, next, next week. Next week. It depends when I get my voucher code thing. Anyway, this is a sample pack of every single Jelly Belly flavor. Now, I actually have the big tubs. I have the, um, not tubs, they come in bags, the Jelly Belly ones. So three flavors total. We have the butter popcorn, we have the toasted marshmallow, and the uh, strawberry one, which one's this called? Strawberry cheesecake. So I'm gonna be trying all three of these in today's video for you guys. This is a highly requested video, uh, well, particularly on TikTok, so I'm gonna make it into like little shorts and TikToks and reels and stuff as well. Um, I've been meaning to make this one for a little while. You guys have been requesting it. Uh, the time to film it is, is now, basically. So here goes nothing. Drop this video a like, comment down below, subscribe if you are new. I think for starters, I'm gonna go with the, where have I put them? This is going well, isn't it? Um, buttered popcorn, because this is the one I'm excited about the most. So I'm gonna put this in the shaker first. Uh, I'm gonna follow the, I'm dropping everything. This is going terribly. It says to go with 300 to 400 ml of water or milk. I'm actually gonna go with water. So bear that in mind for this entire taste test. I don't have any milk. I'm not gonna go to the shop to get some milk specifically for this either. I'm going to taste it with water and I'm going to be honest with you if it tastes like ass, okay? I'm going to be honest with you. Protein tastes better with, with milk. Everybody knows that, generally speaking. So we're going to go with 350 mils of water in my shaker. Okie dokie, 350 mils is in. We have a little scoopy mixer, scoopy thing, mixer thing. Why am I calling it a scooper thing? I don't know what is going on in this video, ladies and gentlemen. Bloop. What I would normally try and do is keep it neat, um, but today I'm just gonna, that's not too bad. Sniff test. That smells remarkable. That smells really good, you know. High hopes for the butter popcorn. So I would normally put my um, protein in my oats. I would normally drink Clearway, which is behind me right now, and I would normally eat my whey protein, right? I would normally make a bowl of oats and put in my, um, what's it called? Uh, protein scoop, normally salt with caramel every single day, pretty much every single day. It tends to just be what I do, right? So this is gonna kind of be alien to me, just drinking flavored protein in this way anyway. So I take it with a pinch of salt, bear that in mind with, with my thoughts and my review. Um, but, hmm, we're gonna taste it anyway. Cheers. Kinda nervous, I hope it doesn't suck. If it sucks, I'll be sad. <laughs> anyway, cheers. That's nice, you know, that is nice. I'm gonna state the obvious, would be better with milk. It would be just that little bit creamier, a little bit milkier, a little bit, the sweetness is there, which is what I like in a protein, right? Hence why I wind up going for all these sweet cranberry and raspberry and peach juices behind me, the clear way, you know, because I have a real sweet tooth. Um, so for me, I would give that with water a seven. I can see it being a nine with milk. I can see it being a 10 in my oats. I've got a big bag of this and I'm starting to think, thank God I've got a big bag of it, you know. So next up, let's go for the strawberry cheesecake. I am honestly the least excited about this. Although that smells freaking amazing as well. <laughs> okay, well they've at least mastered the smells on these flavors, whether, whether or not they're gonna taste amazing, all three of them, I don't know. But the smell of them so far, really, really good. 
can't complain. Cannot complain. There's a little bit too much water in this as well. Bollocks. Oh well. We'll survive. We'll survive. This is the one that I don't actually have a bag of as well. I've got a bag of the butter popcorn and the toasted marshmallow, but not the strawberry because, to be honest, I don't tend to go for strawberry proteins. I tend to go for the more kind of sweet tooth, salted caramel, <laughs> butter popcorn kind of flavours, you know? So it's just, it's not really for me. So I have a feeling that one, I've used too much water, two, I've not used milk, and three, I wouldn't normally go for a strawberry protein. Not in whey, anyway, in clear whey, or like just sweets and stuff, strawberry, fruit, yeah, again, strawberry, but strawberry flavoured protein, not so much. But sniff test. It smells very strawberry y i know that sounds ridiculous but it smells very um authentic should we say it doesn't s it smells like a, a a tub of strawberries like a carton of strawberries whatever you'd call it not like a sweet <sighs> yeah see again if this was with milk it would be just like a freaking strawberry milkshake and it would be lovely but bit watery i used too much water didn't use milk i'd give that a six i'm like i say, i'm gonna be honest with you guys like i'm not gonna work for my protein i have done for a long time i'm not gonna lie to you if it's shit i'll tell you it's shit you know and i feel like a lot of people um over the years have have seen me say that and know that if i say something's not ideal or not amazing then they know it's not that great little palate cleanser. Third, we have the toasted marshmallow. I'm going to mix it in my big shaker, which uh, to be honest, the mixability is one thing that I've definitely got to compliment in this video. Um, I know it's with water, not with milk, so it's not as thick and it's going to mix a little bit easier than, than others. But mixability with proteins is a big deal to a lot of people, myself included. Like if you have to shake something like a mother you just don't you just don't want it because you can't be bothered to make it you can't be bothered to drink it you can't be bothered to wash it up afterwards like all of that kind of stuff it really makes you contemplate actually making it in the first place if that makes sense and i know a lot of you guys at home will probably think oh that's stupid but i know a lot of people watching this video will also resonate with that so let me know in the comments if you if you agree with that if something's difficult to mix or difficult to make just why am I not bothering? People are busy. People lead busy, busy lifestyles, myself included, right? I don't always want to cook something fancy. Like, I enjoy cooking and I do like cooking, um, but I don't always want to make something that's extravagant because you have to wash it up. Sometimes you just want packet rice and some some nicely seasoned chicken and stuff, you know, you know? like very basic bodybuilder stuff, but does the job. So what's this flavour called? Toasted marshmallow. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not getting much from that. I got quite potent smells from the other two, but I'm not getting much from this at all. Screw it. Anyway, cheers. Toasted Marshmallow Jelly Belly Collab with my protein. Oh, let's check, check out. Oh, that's the nicest. Oh, I wasn't expecting that. Okay, here's my Butter popcorn, because for me it's between these two. Toasted marshmallow, butter popcorn. No, I prefer this one. I feel like I prefer this one in oats and this one as a drink, right? Bearing in mind I'm going to eat them, I'm going to eat the protein. I, I say eat because it's going to be in my oats and I'm not going to be drinking it. Like, I'm going to be having it in that form. So I would definitely go with um, the one that I would prefer in the oats the most. But I would give this... I'd give that an eight. I really would. It, with water as well, probably a 10 with, with milk. But let's be real, you can either use 50-50 or you can just use one or the other. I've gone with water today because I can't bother to go to the shop for one. I don't want to buy it just for a video for two. I do not drink milk. I don't drink tea. I don't drink coffee. I don't need milk. So I don't have any. So I'm not going to go and buy some just for this video. But I mean, I probably should have done that. would have been the good thing to do. Probably more accurate taste test for you all. But hey, I hope you enjoyed the video regardless. If you have, let me know by leaving a like, comment down below, subscribe if you are new. Let me know if you have tried any of the Jelly Belly collabs. Let me know if you use code LSJ at checkout this month. 
or the previous month, or the previous month, or the previous month, or if ever. If you buy anything on TikTok shop, please send me a link, like a, not a link, a um, screenshot of your order, and I will do the same. I will add your name into the giveaway. My TikTok shop or code LSJ, I'll stick your names in the giveaway list one way or another. And that's that, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you all for tuning in. I really appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed this one slightly different. Um, what will follow next will not be a deliverable and uh, not be a commitment of mine, if you know what I'm saying, um, and will actually be um, back to vlogging and all that kind of stuff. But videos like this are important. One, to kind of draw new people into the channel. I'm not gonna lie to you, this video over time will probably get more views on average, draw new people into the channel. And two, it's legitimately helpful for people when they decide what they're gonna buy. Like it looks bad on me if they buy something because I said it was quite nice and they don't like it. So if I've taste tested it properly and they can make their assumptions based off of that, it, it's legitimately helpful, you know? So if you have enjoyed this one, let me know by leaving a like, comment down below, subscribe if you are new. Thank you all so much for watching. I appreciate you all. Code LSJ at checkout on all things my protein. Stay tuned for the TikTok lives. Stay tuned for, well, the, the fuck ton of stuff coming in the, in the near future. It's gonna be a cool few months. Stick around, trust me. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you in the next one.